Hello and welcome to more nerdy rodent geekery. This time it is a bit of a hit film speed run. So first things first, make a new project. That so you're going to need a new project so that you can make a new composite shot. Mm, great, new composite shot. Fine, we'll just use the defaults. Great, we'll have a new plane. Stick one of those in there. Doesn't matter. We'll accept the defaults. Bang, defaults. Mm, love it. Next, slam some fractal noise on there. Love a bit of fractal noise. There you go. Sorted. Defaults. Flashy. All right. Parallax. Mmm. Love it. Not quite defaults. Gonna whack it up to maximum and invert it. Ooh, that's made it look a bit funny. So let's make the plane a bit bigger so it doesn't have that funny board around the side. Bit bigger on there. Bit bigger on there. Okay. Smashing. Mmm. Like it. Turn it into 3D. Yes, please. And of course, we'll add a light. Mm. Oh, it's too dark. That's because the light is, well, not in the right place. It's also going to be too bright. So I'll turn it down and move it out a bit. There we go. Now I can see things. And let's have a pretty color. Mm. Blue. There you go. Blue 3D fractal plane. But it's not sort of 3D. It's, it's 2D. But yeah, anyway. Um, yeah, you can move the light around and, well, you can animate it too. So, set the seed at the beginning, set the seed at the end. This is a 30 second clip, so I said it's 0.9. Um, that's, a, you know, a reasonably smooth fractal transition. There you go, you can see it just gently changing there, nice and relaxed. Of course, if you put a seed like 10 at the end, then it will be a really, really fast transition. You can also play with the uh, color. So depending on what you want your heights to be like, you've got the uh, exposure and offset there. It's basically dark and light. And uh, I'll turn the illuminated off just so that uh, it looks a bit better. If you want to rotate fractal and you can just use the rotate under the fractal controls there you go same with the uh, position if you want to move the scene left or right or up and down you can just use the controls in the fractal uh, you can also zoom into the fractal zoom zoom or zoom out of the fractal zoom zoom there you go fractal mm. uh, if you want to tilt it a little bit there you go you can tilt it that way tilt that back also tilt it the other way and obviously all the other rotation controls work as well so you can rotate it all the way around if you want to it doesn't look quite as good that way but hey let's just reset those there you go that's it uh, fractal noise parallax